welcome to another episode of Carbs. Y'all show where we're sitting in the car. MBS Waltz, consuming carbs, consuming carbs. Matt's out along with Val. Uh, make sure to check out Trippy Food, uh, his food review channel down below. Give it a subscribe. Uh, we are finally, finally, Val, going to make up for a wrong. I filmed a review on this place about... Like three years ago, and the audio film? the audio was just oh. shit. Uh, the the wind was too loud. I never posted it. I just it went to the wayside. But I love this place. This is called the Sand Witch, as in like witch, as in Halloween. Um, it's a year round Halloween sandwich shop, and it's delicious. Everybody I've ever taken there loves it. So I took Val here to finally go ahead and give this a my shot. only my only issue is there was nobody in costume in there. Yeah, no, they don't do costumes. Yeah, um, I got the voodoo. What did you get, Val? I got dragon. It says right there, but uh, sadly, there's no actual dragon in here. What What do you think dragon would taste like, though? Probably just chicken. Um, well, I don't know. Do you think alligator tastes like chicken? Alligator tasted like fish. It was like yeah. it was like like, kind a, of like, a, like a combination thing. of seafood mm -hmm. and, and and poultry, I think. Yeah. So I think dragon would taste like alligator. Probably. I think yeah. you're right. All right. It's so a gigantic on, reptile. On mine, the voodoo is chicken, ham, swish, and a uh, swish, <laughs> swiss, and honey mustard on sourdough. And then yours uh, is the Dragon's Breath, which is one of their, granted, it's one of the more popular ones. Uh, but this is chicken breast, pepper jack, bell pepper, a red bell pepper, onion, tomato, jalapeno, ch chipotle, pesto on jalapeno cheese bread. Now, so now, yours uh, is more, much, much more complicated than mine. Right, right. Now, now the thing is, is like they, they call it dragon, dragon Breath, right? Yeah. And uh, and so the assumption is that this is like really, really, really hot. But then there's really nothing hotter than jalapeno in here. Yeah, no, it's just their hottest thing. Yeah. Yeah, it's their hottest thing. So go ahead. You give a bite. I'm taking a... I would go... Oh, we got to take a picture. Give me oh, a picture. Oh, look at that. It's like a, like a panini, right? Yeah, it's just a panini. So... That is nice. They are oh. a bit They are a bit expensive. Um, like for both these sandwiches with tip, it was like 20, 21 bucks. Wow. But the thing is... They are giving you quality. I mean, good. like it's it's my favorite quality sandwich. Dude, I'm sure. That. I'm not gonna push it in your face. No, I've 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 had a bite of it before. I've had the voodoo, by the way, as well. You so, had this one? Yeah, I, I had a buddy who got it, and I I tried some. It's nice. It's like there's a, some. Oh, they give you so much shit in there, and then you can get like the double chicken. Look or at all the cheese. carnage going on in there. Yeah, it looks good. All right, That's let's nice. do it. Right. Oh, I'm so hungry. Who do you voodoo? I think oh, the, so good. I think the red bell peppers in here tone it down a little bit. Mm. Oh wait, oh hang on a second. There's a jalapeno sneaking up on me. Ooh, I also like their buffalo melt. Of course, you have to like buffalo sauce because it's very strong. Um, so I just went with the voodoo because I haven't had it in a while. Yeah, I love this place. Uh, the people in there are always super nice. They went through multiple management um, shifts, but it seems like they've settled on one for now. Um, but it's just a really nice, fun hole in the wall. It's definitely 100% a local mom and pop place, and I love supporting them if I can. I love the voodoo. My favorite is the buffalo one. Uh, but overall, this place is just awesome. I'm going to give it a 5 out of 5 seal of approval. I like the fact that they have a gimmick as well. Um, you're not just going in and getting a sandwich. It's cool that when you walk in, it's got like a Halloween theme. They especially up it during the Halloween season. Um, but then that just ended, so it was a little less than usual. But the place is just really fun overall. What do you think? Me? Uh, I'm not a big fan of chicken in general, but this is like really nice. It's like, um, I'm going to say it. You ready? Mm -hmm. Moist. It's so tight, huh? <laughs> <laughs> um, uh, it's moist, it's not dry, uh, and then uh, it's so chock full of peppers. Mm -hmm. They really get that flavor from the peppers and everything. So this is a this is a really nice sandwich, and I'm going to give it a trippy thumb. Trippy thumb? Yeah. Trippy it's just Tom Cruise again. Don't worry about it. All right. Okay. I'm going to give it a thumbs up. Yeah. Gonna give it a thing. Big, thumb, big thumbs up on this one. So if you have been in the Upland, California area, that's where they're located, uh, and you've tried this, let me know in the comments down below. I've had plenty of uh, fans. I'll post on Instagram and stuff. Uh, and they'll just be like, yeah, I know that place. Like, it's got it's got a following. Um, and also, make sure to check out Val's channel. Give him a subscribe. Uh, hopefully, we'll be seeing Val on a more regular basis. And check out his content. And there you go, guys. What are your thoughts on this? Let them know in the comments down below. What is your favorite, like, go-to sandwich place? Like, not, not making your own. Well, every time I ask this, they always just go, I just make my own. Not make your own. I understand. You can make an epic sandwich. Great. But where do you go when you buy a sandwich if you do? I we used to go to Quiznos all the time. But then, you know, they all closed down around here. So, there's Dude, one like, in... Uh, Pasadena Sandwich Company. There's one in Rancho. What's pa Pasadena Sandwich Company? Oh, my God. You haven't been there yet? Mm -mm. You need to do an episode there. Okay. Well, let's do it. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you're all having a great day. And we'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm.